Time now to add a classical touch. Our illusionist combines two of his hobbies to create an impossible impression. Here is Chris Funk. Thank you. Well, it is card trick time, because heck, what is a magic show without an abundance of card tricks? Let's get crazy, have a bunch of you select some playing cards. Looks like you can hardly wait down here. Hello. What is your name? Fabiola. Fabiola, I'm going to have you select one of these playing cards. The way you're going to do it is by saying the word stop as I riffle down the card. Here we go. Stop. You happy with that spot right there? Excellent. Fabiola, I want you to take the card you stopped me at and memorize it, please. All right? Miss, right here, what is your name? Nicole. You ready for this? Here we go. Stop. You happy with that spot right there? Excellent. Nicole, I want you to take the card you stopped me at. I want you to memorize it, show it to a bunch of people. Uh, last but not least, Miss, what is your name? Alicia. Alicia, here we go. Stop. Nailed it. You want to change your mind? You happy with the mind you have? <laughs> I want you to go ahead, take that card, memorize it. Fabiola, I'm going to have you place the card back wherever you'd like in the pack, please. Fabiola, thank you very much. Nicole, place it back here. I like how you're leaving them sticking out. Makes it a whole lot easier for me to find them in a moment. <laughs> Alicia, go ahead, place the card back here. And, uh, okay, I need a bit of a challenge with these three cards. Can you just help me out and give them a little mixy mix, a little shuffle? Just don't change the order. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, I'll take those. Personal anecdote time. Didn't always know that I was going to be a magician. No, I thought I was going to be a musician. Okay, let me rephrase. My parents told me I was going to be a musician. Anyone feeling my pain? Yeah. Parents broke the news to me at the age of six when they said I'd be taking music lessons on the violin. Played for 10 years, broke my parents' hearts, and quit. I'd always wondered what it would look like if I combined my love of music with my love of magic, and I figure that now's the time and this is the place. One by one, you're gonna name your card out loud, and I'm gonna see if I can match the music to the card and cause something really amazing to take place. Fabiola, we're gonna start with you. The card you selected was? Three. Three. Uh, Three of spades, thank you very much. Three of spades, so this is how it works. Three's a small number, a little number. Fun. Spades, always sophisticated. So we need something fun, get sophisticated. Sounds like a job from Mozart. <clears throat> Here we go. <laughs> okay, I get it. I get it. You're like, yeah, there was a handkerchief on top. We'll do it without. Uh, Nicole, next, the card you selected was? Queen of Diamonds. Queen of Diamonds. Ooh, Queen Elegant Diamonds. Elegant. Ah, someone just shout out their favorite artist. Anyone, shout one out. Bach, I like it. Song by Bach, I think I know one. Beret in G major by Bach. To show you this is not pre-recorded, I will insert a wrong note. Yes. Last but not least, Alicia, what was the card that you selected? Ace of Hearts. We're gonna have to do something a little bit more spectacular for that to happen with an ace. Something a little like this. Nailed it. Yeah.